Okay, good morning. If I keep forgetting to record movies throughout the day, I might just have to combine multiple days into one. So you're gonna have lots of good morning and tasteless. <sighs> so yesterday I got everything done. We went to that play, um, Something Rotten. It's it's pretty funny. It's it like it's a musical that makes fun of musicals. Um, and it has a bunch of musicals in it, but it's set in the Shakespeare Shakespearean time. Not necessarily kid appropriate. There's a little, quite a bit of swearing in it. Hi. Hi. You're home. You already left. You came back. Yeah, I already left. Anyhow. Coffee money. Oh, gotcha. So it's not something I would necessarily recommend for kids, but it was funny for adults. A lot of good music. A lot of good music and fun songs. Um, and a funny story. So. Today, I've got my sister's magazine to finish up our draft for the editor and then the OCQT website. I got to sync some of that up with PayPal and a few things. Um, homeschool wise, nice. I should show the camera what you're doing right now. He's <laughs> wagging his tush at me. Um, homeschool wise, today is home ec and technology. So Addie's been begging me. Love you. Love you. Bye. Addie's been begging me to make Rice Krispies. So we're going to make Rice Krispies today. And Tech, I'm thinking we'll pull out the saltwater race cars. We were going to do that last week or the week before. And anyway, we still haven't done it. So, um, And then I need to gas up my car for tomorrow because tomorrow I take Kenzie up to college. Yay! And then... Um, Oh, bedroom. I was trying to read that backwards. Um, I'm going to start, if I get in enough time, I want to start kind of working on a little bit of things in my room because starting Sunday, I'm going to be moving my office that's here in my bedroom into Kenzie's room. So yay. So in going out to the garden this morning, we found a little surprise. Nine eggs these chickens have been laying, not in their coop, but in the in the pen in a random place so Jordan found these this morning we're gonna do the water test on them um, if you don't know how to do that or what it is search my YouTube channel and there's a video that shows you the water test how you can test if an egg is good or bad I, I don't have high hopes because we don't know how long these eggs have been there so we're gonna test them all first and see if they're good or bad so we'll see but surprise surprise we need to do something with the the chickens on where they're laying their eggs and not all of them I think it's just one or two laying them in this weird spot so gotta address that soon all right I'm gonna show you really quick this watermelon smoothie look at this so all this is literally all it is is watermelon we just cut up the watermelon and put ice on top we'll probably have to add a little more ice once we start the blender and get the watermelon down we usually add a little more ice and then i put a few packets of this true lime and that's it so let me show you sometimes we have to stop it and use a knife to kind of mix it up and then try again Okay, now that it's blended, I'm just gonna add some more ice. Oh, and it looks like we got, oh no, that's the sides. I thought we had a, thought we had a black seed in there, but we don't. This is so delicious. It is so good. It turns into like a, like a watermelon Slurpee. <laughs> but it's so, so good. Okay, so I added a little bit more ice. And that's it. So, whoa, there goes our lid. So look at this. Oops. It's like, seriously, it's like a watermelon Slurpee, but it is so good. It's just watermelon ice and the true lime. So yummy. And watermelon's actually pretty good for you.